Hello everyone, Tino Finati here to show you the Microsoft Link 2013 client for Microsoft uh, Windows 8RT. Um, I have it here installed on a Microsoft Surface. The, the greatest enhancement over the mobile client is the ability to make IP-based voice and video calls over Wi-Fi. And uh, that uh, voice and video calls locally processed by the uh, by the, own, the ARM processor here on the Microsoft Surface in this case. Uh, you can see here that um, this is in fact a live tile, so it is showing my, showing my presence and my availability. And we'll just tap on the tile here to uh, launch the client. A very familiar uh, Metro UI interface um, seen across Windows 8 products. On the left hand side here you have uh, any uh, scheduled or in uh, link meetings in progress. These are the three core areas of the link client, uh, contacts, history, and uh, voicemail. On the top right here we have uh, the uh, my presence here, uh, the corporate picture, uh, the uh, what's happening today field, uh, your current um, uh, call forwarding status, and then one touch access to uh, the ability to change um, <clears throat> your presence here and your call forwarding status and the ability to sign out from the client altogether. Um, if you swipe on any of the uh, windows within link here, the link client, uh, swipe down from uh, from the top here, um, you can see that you have uh, menu options here. The active window is represented by the one highlighted in blue. In this case, it's the link homepage or main menu. Um, you have access to contacts, conversation history, and your voicemail. On the uh, bottom right here is the ability to make a phone call uh, by dialing a number. So we'll just tap on there. And again, this is a uh, this is a IP based call over Wi-Fi, um, not PSTN callback um, as they have in the mobile clients. So you type in a number, you hit call. Um, I do have a USB um, headset here, uh, Jabra headset that I have attached to the uh, to the USB port on the Microsoft Surface. So we'll just click call here, and then we're now making a call to this phone that's now ringing. When you're in an active call, again, in any active window, you can uh, just swipe down from the top and you can see that you have an active call here represented by, highlighted in blue here. And just exit to stop that call there. Um, you have contacts here on the main page, um, as you would on your PC-based client. It does actually sync, your groupings do sync with uh, your PC-based client and you can also change and manipulate them here as well. Um, so just swipe left to right and choose, for example, we'll tap on sales here and the uh, sales group will load on the left hand side here. Um, however, you do have access to all your contacts by swiping left to right and they're uh, sorted here by groups. Um, you can also sort by name here and I'll sort them alphabetically. And again, swipe left to right just to access your contacts. To interact with the contact, you just uh, tap on the name here and you'll see you have access to all the, the Microsoft link modalities here, I can start an IM conversation, a voice call, video call. I can access their Outlook contact card as you would with your PC. I can also access a shortcut menu here to add this contact to a favorites to a different group or to remove the con from the contacts list. So I'll start an IM session here. Very uh, Skype looking uh, interface. And you can see I'm in an active IM session right now. Again, in this window, I can bring down the uh, options. I have access to um, menu options here, navigation, navigation options. And then um, I am in an active IM call here, or IM conversation here represented uh, highlighted in blue. But I can easily escalate this call, uh, this IM um, chat to a call uh, or to a voice call or to a video call here. Uh, on the left hand side here, I can um, add more participants, which I'll do now. Tap on that. Active participants window shows up. Uh, I can invite more people here. And I can type in a phone number, a PSTN phone number, or a name of contact in, in my network here. And uh, Jim pops up here. I will tap on him and add him to the. Um, add him to the uh, IM conversation I'm having. And as you can see now, that uh, they're they're both there added. Um, you can see now the active conversation. It's an active conversation with three participants now, instead of just the initial the initial party. I can also now add, let's say, go to another contact, and add, and, and start a conversation with another user, for example. And um, you can see now if I go to the options menu, um, 
you can see now that the simple conversations are now populated along the top right hand side here and I can easily swap between between them and I can also just as easy now exit out of these conversations by by tapping the X if we um, go to conversation history now this client does synchronize with exchange to pull all the conversation history so you can see all the inbound outbound calls that have been placed the conferences that have been held um, all, your, all your IM conversations as well and you can quite simply just tap on the chat here to continue the chat um, voicemail voicemail is actually pretty neat again tile interface uh, Metro UI interface here and um, <clears throat> shows the caller ID the date stamp the length of the message and I'll pull my headset out here so that you can hear the speaker. But it's an embedded player. You quite simply just tap play here, and you hear it coming through the integrated speakers here. Um, you can also interact with that message by tapping on it. Now, obviously, we can't IM with this PSTN phone number. However, we can um, call that number right back. And you can see here now that I still have the active conversations populated. Um, that's pretty much it for the Link uh, 2013 client for Windows 8 RT. Um, very highly optimized, very smooth, very fast. Um, the, the, the voice quality, video quality over Wi-Fi is impeccable. It's actually been really great and really impressed with it so far. So uh, thanks, for, thanks for watching and hopefully there's more to come. Thanks. Bye for now.